No. Yes. What was that? A 104. Let's go. What up, in this John's your boy IBS Kelso coming back with another MX Bikes banger. Now, before you adjust your phone brightness or change your minor settings, yes, I am black and playing a dirt bike game. Today, I'm just gonna go ahead and start on Anaheim One, and I'm just gonna get my practice in. By what I mean by that is, I feel like I definitely need so much work in Supercross, especially if I keep talking about I wanna I wanna try to at least qualify for uh, amateur Supercross coming up this year for 2024 season. And I feel like I keep saying it, but I'm not actually putting in the effort. So this is just gonna be me documenting my time of literally at least trying to put down a video of at least 10 to 15 minutes and just running pure raw laps. So I'm gonna talk about it as much as I can, probably focus up sometimes, but I know for sure my thing is I'm OJing. I never know what the right amount, I guess, speed I need to carry over some of these jumps. And I never know the right amount of gearing I need to be for whoops. But I will say I am running uh, medium tires. I am running a 1250 sprocket. Uh, let me know down in the comment section if that's wrong. And I'm also running the highest rod length. I think rod length in your rear sprocket and all that is what gives you more torque. And I feel like I have such a trouble clearing things. So I want as much torque as I can to the back wheel. And I feel like so far that's kind of like where I've been uh, struggling at. So I'm going to continue on that basis and kind of touch up in there and continue to work on my setup. But shout out to Morgan. He definitely gave me a pretty good setup for this Kawasaki. Uh, if you guys don't know who Morgan is, he is our Weto Racing, my, my Weto Racing mechanic, as well as Mints, but he's more the uh, main guy now. And uh, yeah, I feel like I do have it, and I feel I just need to continuously put down good laps and consistency. Instead of trying to go for burners, I need to worry about staying straight, actually keeping my momentum. So that's probably what we're going to focus on here. You know, it may not look super pretty and I do apologize because like I'm not a pro by any means necessary, but I know I need to work on it. So right here, just take it nice and easy round it. Now, I feel like my corner speed is pretty OK. I feel like my corner speed is pretty OK. I think my biggest thing is just understanding how much power I need to give things like. I feel like that was OK, but I feel like I should I could have probably shifted up the third gear right there and got way more torque to the back wheel. And that right there kind of messed me up. I got in the whoops. So it's, I mean, tough block. So that's going to mess me up through the whoops. I was actually able to survive. I think that rod length and then your sprocket is, I think the rod length is huge. I think more torque to the back wheel is going to help out. Let me know if I'm wrong. Let me know if I'm wrong. But I think more torque to the back wheel is going to help you out more in these whoops. Only because you need to keep more speed going through. As soon as you slow down, it kind of keeps you out of rhythm. So the more speed you can keep in, the, the better. There we go. Quad that out. Oh man. All right. So I didn't, I didn't, I didn't break tab, then slow down enough in there. And I understood what was wrong there. So next time we'll give her a go, but I was able to conquer that. I'm going to just go ahead and come back this way. Cause I do want to try to get that triple in. If not, it's going to be, and then, yeah, there we go. Third gear. See, I tried to go up to third gear and I OJ it. So possibly there's when people say, you know, if you're going to, if you're going to over jump, then start break tapping. And I feel like that's what I need to start learning to do, <clears throat> but it's okay trial and error i felt like i have three bikes though i will say i have like three bikes i want to keep practicing on um is the kawasaki honda and then the yamaha at the moment i tried the ktm um i heard the husqvarna is probably the best suit but i just don't think i want to go to the husqvarna right now um i don't know what it is it's probably in my own account i might do double double single right now until i feel like i'm comfortable enough to give uh the, the double to a triple but yeah those are my three bikes right now let me know if I'm wrong as well, but I think this Kawasaki, as soon as I can get it dialed in and I get more consistent, it's going to be the, my go-to bike for Supercross. I mean, it's already my go-to bike for outdoors, and I feel like now I have a pretty good uh, motocross outdoors and indoors, so we'll be fine with that. But I'm running a 106. I think, I think like, what? what's a really good time here? Like a, a 58 or something like that? If I can get under a minute, that'd be really cool. I think I just literally just hit my marks. Hit my marks. There we go. That's huge. Brake tap. You saw the brake tap? Come in close. I like that. Uh, I'm not gonna. Okay. I was trying to clutch in. Uh, come in close. I feel like I should have just. Uh, I try. I try to get over that hump. I should say. Couldn't do it. So we'll come back around and try that. I feel like that's definitely gonna slow me down at least a second because I do have to. I feel like this is a faster line. So. And then here, I cut in close. Oh, that actually didn't feel too bad. I almost got it. I mean, it was a case. It was a case. That was a 105. Okay, let's go a little stronger. Let's go a little stronger. Let's go here. 
and I accidentally stood I actually sat down actually acc accidentally sat down right there oh man well hopefully everybody's day is going great I am recording this on Friday happy Friday um hopefully everybody's just having a great week and we're guys we go into the weekend so you guys will see this on Saturday but thank you guys for 3200 subs as well I literally you guys are amazing man just thank you guys so much for literally just keeping up all that support I'm gonna definitely keep cranking out okay right there it's huge that's huge break tap okay you see the break tap okay break tap okay break tap again kind of over send kind of over sending too much break I locked up the front wheel that's okay hey, as long as I feel like I'm understanding where I'm messing up that's all it is because right now I feel like I can't ever put down a full consistent lap and as you can see it I, I feel like I still haven't put down a full consistent lap so I know where I need to get better and faster at and that's just that's what these videos are gonna be about next I'll go to like uh round two and we'll just see what's up we'll try we'll try our best out of 10 to 15 minutes and see if you guys like it so you enjoy it see if i see if i was able to get better or i got worse <laughs> you know see if i got better or i got worse right now my best is a 105 so all right i think right now whoops fourth gear make sure you touch the front yep maybe i should battle him i should battle my ghost I feel like I haven't thought about that at all. Let's battle him. Oh, see, I got out of sync. I got out of sync right there. I thought I was, I thought I was moving. I should have probably went down the second, got a little bit more torque, then went back to up to third. But I thought I was battling. That's who I wanted to battle. It's all right. We're going to come back to it. Brake tap, back wheel, triple. You can probably stay low. Oh, that looks good. Ooh, I look good right there. Oh my God, yo, that guy mo. Let's go, baby. Let's finish it. Man, I look like Splash, bro. I was watching Splash. Shout out to Splash, weird. I was watching Splash, bro. Splash, man, gave me so like great insight on this game. A lot of help. Shout out to him. I'm sorry he had, he had the... He didn't want to be a mod no more for the streams. All good, though. I felt like I understand, you know, going into bigger and better things. So, but yeah, I felt like he's definitely helped out a lot. I feel like Sets has helped out a lot. Shout out to the Red Racing Everybody's just come, coming through, man. Shout out to Panda. I feel like more and more, every time I soak in what they're saying, it's like I'm like a sponge instead of like going in one ear and out the other. And I can tell, I can feel like myself getting better. I just got to keep up the consist. I got to keep up the grind. Like I keep saying that I want to do it. And then I don't. Okay. Once again, that's twice, guys. Twice. Twi twice right now that I've like literally messed up on those second whoops and i get it I, I feel like i'm just not keeping the momentum let's go table on off third gear quad brake tap second gear Ooh, seat bounce you guys saw the seat bounce brake tap again oh my god let's go i'll take that okay basically don't touch it at all let's go i i think my goal right now is to try to get under a 105 I feel like I have it in me. I, I feel like I have a 103 in me. Just a consistent lap. And I, I feel like right now, where it's at, the whoops. The whoops is what's killing me. So, hey, that's okay with me. <gasps> Let's go. You guys see it, man. Progress, bait. Oh. That was almost easy mode. You guys see the progress, bro. You guys literally see the progress. Maybe third gear? I keep going up the I keep going up the fourth gear. Maybe I'm losing a lot of momentum because of fourth gear. Maybe, maybe, maybe third gear. Whoops. Maybe third gear. Whoops. That'll be fine. And then we'll, we'll come back around and fix this up as well. So I feel like so far everything that I have said that I want to fix, I keep having trouble at. But hey, it's only day one of Anaheim one. So let's go third gear. Sit back up. There we go. There we go. Brake tap. Kind of OJ. We'll still take it. I'll still take it, dude. I promise. Anybody out there that's also struggling with Supercross, I feel like if this pays off, I'll tell everybody, man, just do exactly what I had, I just did like right now. Literally, just come out here, try to make a video of it. I feel like that's what I need to do. I need to make a video of it because it's actually going to like, I feel like it's going to help me in the long run to show like show my progress. And on top of that, it's going to make me like come out here and actually spend some time on here because I feel like I'm so 
I'm so busy with streaming. I'm so busy trying to make other videos. And it's like, this is really where I need to get better at. And I feel like a lot of people don't have super cross tracks. So I feel like that's what hinders me a lot since I can't ever do it on stream. Oh, 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 oh I can't believe I saved that. Hold on. Can I beat him? Never mind. I'm over the top. All right, here we go. This is the real one. I feel I don't have any E-Road crazy. I think it's only like 0.10. Only because, like, I feel like I shouldn't have to worry about E-Road yet. And I feel like I should worry about that down the road as I get better. But I feel like I should just run these tracks. No E-Road. So I can just kind of focus on consistency before I try to focus on doing anything else. But I'm right here with my freaking ghost. Maybe this will help a lot. Let's try to beat him. Let's try to beat him. Quad out. There we go. Third gear. See, I I've got the speed. There we go. I've got the corner speed. Oh, let's go. Oh, he's like right on me. There we go. I feel like I'm low-key focusing up because I feel like I can make this. I feel like I can make this huge. No, yes. What was that? A 104! Let's go! Let's go! Dang it! <laughs> All right, I think that's the video, guys. I do appreciate you guys. Like I said, I, I just wanted to come on here, show my practice, show off you guys that I'm actually going to put in the work instead of talking about it. I'm going to be about it. I think it's a huge thing. Don't talk about it, be about it. So this is this is actually my day one of, of actually working on Supercross. And um, yeah, shout out to everybody else that's uh, focusing up and trying to do it. I hope I get to compete against anybody out there and especially in amateurs and try to make my way up to pro. Don't see it happening anytime soon, but I at least want to put in that effort. So yeah, other than that's your boy IBS Kelso and thank you guys so much for watching. Oh God. And uh, yeah, before I crash again, I'll see you guys in the next one. Pop, 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 p